Hey everyone, welcome to Byte Guardian, and today we're diving into the world of Enterprise Linux with Rocky Linux. This is a fascinating journey through the evolution of server operating systems and how they have shaped the backbone of modern enterprises. But first, let's rewind a bit and understand where it all began. Before Rocky Linux, there was CentOS, a name synonymous with reliability and performance in the server world. This Linux distribution was a rock in the server room, known for its stability and affordability. It was the unsung hero that powered countless data centers and server rooms across the globe. It was the go-to choice for businesses of all sizes, from small startups to large enterprises providing a robust and cost-effective solution for their server needs. Why? Because it was a clone of Red Hat Enterprise Linux, a powerhouse in the enterprise world. Rachel was known for its enterprise-grade features, security, and support. CentOS provided the same rock-solid performance as RHL, but without the licensing costs, making it an attractive option for budget-conscious businesses. This made it a no-brainer for businesses looking for a reliable and cost-effective server operating system. It allowed them to allocate resources to other critical areas while still maintaining a high level of performance and security. Think of it like this. CentOS was the open-source twin of RHL, offering the same great features without the hefty price tag. It was like getting a premium product for free. This made it a favorite among developers and system administrators alike. They could rely on CentOS to provide a stable and predictable environment for their applications and services. For years, CentOS reigned supreme in the server world. Its stability and predictability made it the perfect platform for businesses to build and run their operations. Its stability and predictability made it the perfect platform for businesses to build and run their operations. Companies could trust CentOS to keep their services running smoothly, without unexpected downtime or performance issues. The community was thriving with developers and users collaborating to make CentOS even better. This open source collaboration led to continuous improvements and innovations, ensuring that CentOS remained at the forefront of server technology. However, the tech world is always changing and in 2020, Red Hat, the company behind RHL, announced a major shift in its strategy. This decision sent shockwaves through the Linux community. This change would have a ripple effect throughout the Linux community, particularly for CentOS users. Many were left wondering about the future of their trusted operating system. This marked the beginning of a new chapter in the story of Enterprise Linux. With the end of CentOS as we knew it, a new player emerged to fill the void, Rocky Linux. Rocky Linux was created to continue the legacy of CentOS, providing a stable and reliable operating system for enterprises. It was built by the community, for the community, ensuring that the spirit of open source collaboration lived on. The development of Rocky Linux was a testament to the power of the open source community. Developers from around the world came together to create a new, robust, and secure operating system that businesses could rely on. Today, Rocky Linux is quickly becoming the go-to choice for businesses looking for a reliable and cost-effective server operating system. It offers the same great features and performance as CentOS, with the added benefit of a vibrant and active community. As we look to the future, it's clear that Rocky Linux will play a crucial role in the world of enterprise Linux. Its commitment to stability, performance, and community-driven development makes it a worthy successor to CentOS. So, whether you're a developer, a system administrator, or a business owner, Rocky Linux offers a powerful and reliable solution for your server needs. Stay tuned as we continue to explore the exciting world of Enemy, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more tech insights and updates. Red Hat's announcement sent shockwaves through the tech community. The news spread like wildfire, leaving many in disbelief and sparking intense discussions at tech conferences and online forums. They decided to discontinue CentOS as we knew it and replace it with CentOS Stream. This decision marked a significant departure from the traditional model that many had come to rely on. This new version of CentOS was positioned as a rolling release, meaning it would receive continuous updates instead of the traditional stable releases. For developers, this meant access to the latest features and improvements, but it also came with its own set of challenges. While this might sound appealing to some, it was a deal-breaker for many enterprise users. Businesses that depended on the rock-solid stability of CentOS for their mission-critical applications found themselves in a precarious position. CentOS was known for its stability and predictability, which were crucial for businesses running mission-critical applications. 
The assurance that their systems would remain stable and secure was a cornerstone of their operations. CentOS Stream, with its rolling release model, introduced an element of uncertainty that made many enterprises uneasy. The continuous updates meant that changes could be introduced at any time, potentially disrupting carefully maintained systems. The community backlash was swift and fierce. Online forums were flooded with heated discussions and many voiced their frustration and disappointment. The sense of betrayal was palpable. Many felt betrayed by Red Hat's decision as it disrupted their workflows and jeopardized the stability of their systems. System administrators who had spent years perfecting their setups now faced an uncertain future. The once thriving CentOS community was left in disarray, searching for a new home. The sense of unity and shared purpose that had defined the community was now fractured. This shift in the Linux landscape created a vacuum, a need for a new champion to emerge and carry the torch of what CentOS represented. Enter Rocky Linux. Named after one of the original co-founders of CentOS, Rocky Linux aimed to fill the void left by CentOS, promising the same level of stability and reliability that users had come to expect. The community rallied around this new project, hopeful that it would restore the balance and provide a stable foundation for their systems once again. In the wake of the CentOS stream announcement, a familiar face stepped up to offer a solution. The announcement had left many in the open source community feeling uncertain and concerned about the future of their systems. Enterprises and developers alike were searching for a reliable alternative that could fill the void left by CentOS. Gregory Kurtzer, the original founder of CentOS, decided to create a new community-driven distribution that would stay true to the spirit of CentOS. He recognized the need for a stable, secure, and compatible operating system that enterprises could depend on. With his extensive experience and deep understanding of the community's needs, Kurtzer was well positioned to lead this new initiative. This new distribution was named Rocky Linux, a tribute to the late Rocky McGaw, a co-founder of CentOS. McGaw's contributions to the open source community were significant and naming the new project after him was a way to honor his legacy and the values he stood for. Rocky Linux was built from the ground up to be a true drop-in replacement for CentOS. This meant that users could transition to Rocky Linux without having to worry about compatibility issues or disruptions to their existing workflows. The development team focused on ensuring that the new distribution would meet the high standards set by CentOS. It aimed to provide the same stability, security, and compatibility that enterprises had come to rely on. The team behind Rocky Linux understood that these qualities were non-negotiable for businesses that depended on their IT infrastructure to run smoothly and securely. The project quickly gained momentum, attracting a dedicated community of developers and users who were eager to contribute to its success. This enthusiastic support was a testament to the trust and respect that Kurtzer and his team had earned within the open source community. What set Rocky Linux apart was its commitment to community governance. Unlike some other projects that might be driven by corporate interests, Rocky Linux was built on the principles of transparency, open communication, and collaboration. This approach ensured that the project would remain true to its roots and be guided by the needs and desires of its users. The project was built on the principles of transparency, open communication, and collaboration. These principles were not just buzzwords, they were the foundation of how the project operated. Regular community meetings, open forums for discussion, and a transparent decision-making process were all integral parts of the Rocky Linux ethos. This ensured that the community had a voice in the direction of the project and that Rocky Linux would remain true to its roots as a community-driven distribution. The inclusive approach fostered a sense of ownership and pride among contributors, making them feel like an essential part of the project's success. With its strong leadership, clear mission, and unwavering community support, Rocky Linux was poised to become the successor to the CentOS legacy. The project not only aimed to fill the gap left by CentOS, but also to build on its foundation, creating an even more robust and resilient platform for the future. The journey of Rocky Linux was just beginning, but it was already clear that it had the potential to make a lasting impact on the open source landscape. So what makes Rocky Linux so special? Why should you care? Well, for starters, it's built on the same foundation as RHL, which means you're getting enterprise-grade stability and security without the enterprise price tag. But it's more than just a clone. Rocky Linux is all about choice and flexibility. You see, with Rocky Linux, you're not locked into any one vendor or ecosystem. 
You have the freedom to choose the tools and technologies that best suit your needs. This is crucial in today's rapidly evolving tech landscape where agility and adaptability are paramount. Rocky Linux also boasts a robust and active community. This means you'll have access to a wealth of knowledge, support, and resources. Whether you're a seasoned sysadmin or just starting out, you'll find a welcoming and helpful community ready to assist you. This community-driven approach is at the heart of Rocky Linux's success. But how does it stack up against the competition? All right, let's take a look at how Rocky Linux compares to other CentOS alternatives. Transitioning from CentOS to Rocky Linux is designed to be smooth and straightforward. The developers have ensured that users can easily migrate their systems without significant disruptions. This seamless process helps maintain productivity and minimizes downtime. Now let's talk about the advantages and disadvantages of Rocky Linux. One major advantage is its strong community support and commitment to staying true to the original goals of CentOS. Users can expect regular updates in a stable environment. However, it's important to consider that, as a relatively new project, there might be some growing pains. But overall, the benefits often outweigh the challenges. The impact of Rocky Linux on the open source community has been significant. It has provided a reliable alternative for those who relied heavily on CentOS. Organizations and individuals have embraced Rocky Linux, contributing to its rapid growth and development. This collaborative effort has strengthened the open source ecosystem as a whole. Getting started with Rocky Linux is quite simple. First, visit the official Rocky Linux website to download the latest version. Follow the installation guide, which provides step-by-step -step instructions. Once installed, familiarize yourself with the system and explore the various resources available to help you get the most out of Rocky Linux. Happy experience.